Rob's a disappointing evening for the New Saints. Yeah, I think it took us a while to get going to be honest. Uh, obviously they started well and then we came back into the game and then I thought we were going to go and win it then but then obviously they got the sucker punch goal just before half time and it knocked us back a little bit and then second half we just had to keep trying to go and get a result but it just didn't happen tonight. We went 1-0 down then we got the equaliser that was another Ryan Brobel super goal. Yeah, it's always nice to get on the score sheet but I'd much rather have the three points and get on the score sheet so yeah. And it was 2-1 to Cardiff Met at half time. What did Scott have to say in the dressing room? He just said keep going really, we'll get the chances and we did we did get them to be fair, we just didn't manage to take them. It just wasn't our night, but yeah, just keep going. And the second 45, frustrating in some ways? Yeah, obviously they knew what they were doing, they slowed the player down, there was like a lot of time taking goal kicks and stuff, but we knew they were going to do that, they're going to defend what they've got, so yeah. And there were one or two appeals for penalties, a ball in the back of the head, Jamie Mullen, got that of course offside. Yeah I'd like to see that back to be fair I think it possibly could have been onside but as you say it just wasn't our night and uh, I'm just taking up next week now. And up next is Boxing Day to visit to Kevin Druids who themselves have been playing well of late. Yeah I think they've been flying they've beat a few teams around us to be fair helped us out a little bit but yeah we won't take them lightly and we've got a double header against them in the space of four or five days so yeah looking forward to it. A disappointing night for the New Saints, but we still go into Christmas, top of the table. Yeah, of course, that's the main thing, and uh, hopefully we can uh, take it in the New Year as well. Robs, as always, thank you for your time. Thank you.